Aloha everyone! Today I'm going to give you an introduction to ukulele tab or tablature, which is the term that we use for finger picking notation. It can be pretty intimidating for a new player to read all those lines and numbers, so I'm going to break it all down for you and we're going to play the song Happy Birthday because it's a tune that everybody knows and then you can use your ear to see if you're playing it correctly or not. So you might want to download a chord chart. There's a link up here and in the description box below. I'm going to be displaying graphics of the tabs, but it might be easier to have it all laid out in front of you. So that's an option. So we're going to start with the first measure of the song. So you see it up here. And the main thing is, what do we do with all these lines and numbers? Well, you can see that there are four lines there and those four lines represent your four strings and they're even the string names at the side um, you'll notice that you go from the bottom g c e a and a lot of people ask why is the a on the top um, it's just a convention that we put the g on the bottom the way i think of it is that i look down at my ukulele and i see g c e a and so then if I were to lay my ukulele on top of the paper, it would line up, right? The G would be on the bottom, G, C, E, A. So that's the way I think of it. And it helps me to see this laid out with the tab. So the first measure sounds like this. Happy birthday to you. So we're gonna first just focus on the first four notes, okay? It just sounds like this. Happy birthday. And you can see that everything for those first four notes happens on just one string, just the C string, okay? Now look at the numbers that are happening on the C string. You have zero, zero, two, zero. So what that means is uh, the numbers represent the fret that you're supposed to press down on with the left hand on that given string. So zero actually means open or no fret, open string, no fret. So that means with your right hand, you just pluck a C string. So open, 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 which is happy, right? So zero, zero, then the left hand has to come and I'm gonna use my middle finger, but you can use whatever finger you want right now, right? To press down on the second fret, right? And this is gonna be your birth, and then you're going back to open. So just let go of it, day. So zero, zero, two, zero. So that's your left hand thinking zero, zero, two, zero. And then the right hand is plucking the C string the whole time, okay? I'm gonna get a little closer so you can see that. Right? So left hand, zero, zero, two, zero. Okay, I'll sing it. Happy birthday. One more time. Happy birthday. Right hand just plucks that C string the whole time. Okay? So it's a bit of coordination of what you do with the left hand and which string you pluck with the right hand. So you can pause there, give yourself a little time to just absorb the concept, practice that part of it. Uh, after that, we can move on and add the parts that come after. Happy birthday. And then we go to another string, which is a little bit harder. But if all you come away with is happy birthday, then that's still a win. You're still on the path to reading tab. Okay, so let's add on happy birthday. Now we're going to the E string. Hopefully you can see that, right? Now we're going to the first fret on the E string. Two. And then we go open on the E string. You. Okay? So let's just look at that close up. Two E string, right? G, C, E, first fret. Two. And then open. You. Now let's do it all together. Happy birthday. Back to the 0020 on the C string. Happy birthday. Okay, now move to the E string. First fret, two, and then open. You, okay? I'm gonna come back because my arm is a little tired. All right, so I'm gonna count out the numbers and let's try to do that together. Ready? We'll go. Oh, oh, two, oh. So 
switch to the E string. One, oh. So for some people, numbers might be easier. For other people, singing it and just hearing the melody might be easier. It's just time to play with it and allow your brain to talk to your fingers. Okay, so that's our first measure, right? Happy birthday to you. That might be enough. You can pause there, rewind, practice that. The second measure uses the same first four notes. Happy birthday. And then the to you is uh, on the E string. Okay, so take a look up here. Now you're moving to your third fret on the E string. You have three and one on the E string. You can use just one finger and move it around if you want to kind of build a good habit of, uh, of fretting with the left hand, then actually you can give each finger a fret and then use your ring finger, right, for the three, two, and then use your, on, we're on the E string now, right, three, and then you're going to the one and then just lift up. Okay, I'll do that a little closer. So you go on the E string, you're going, this is just the to you, third fret, right? You're pressing this down, to, and then lift up for the first fret. You, one more time, to, you. Let's put that together with the happy birthday. Back to the C string, O, O, two, O. Happy birthday. Now moving to the E string, right? Put together your fingers here on the E string. Third fret, two. Lift up for the first fret. You. Okay, more in flow now. Ready? From the C string. Happy birthday, E string. To you. Okay? So let's try to put the first two measures together. And remember, they both start with the O, O, two, O. So if that's the part you know, focus on that. Right, you'll pick up the rest of it slowly. Yeah, take your time with it. Here we go. Right, from the top, slowly and O, O, two, O. Move to the E string, first fret. One, O. Okay, second measure, same thing, O, O, two, O, C string. O, O, two, O. Now E string again. Now stack up for your three and one. Right, E string, three, Okay, I'm gonna count it sometimes and sing it sometimes. Hopefully one of those will help you. Okay, let's do it from the top with singing. Ready and open. Happy birthday, E string, to you. Okay, back to O, O, two, O, C string. Happy birthday, E string with your three, to you. Okay, so pause there if you need to practice. We're gonna go on to the third measure, which is the hardest measure because we're moving uh, across three strings, okay? So the, luckily the, the first two notes are the same, are the happy, are open, open, right? Then you can see we move to the A string. So third fret on the A string. So happy, third fret A string. And open, okay, one more time from the top of the third measure, we'll go happy A string, third fret, birth, and open, day, okay, and now we move to the E string, dear, first fret, dear, and then we're open again, let's say chewy, right, open, chew, and then um, we're moving to the C string, second fret, so there's a lot of movement here, chewy, Okay, so I'm gonna count it. There's still the movement between the strings that makes it a little bit uh, more challenging, but hang on as best you can. We'll go slowly, okay? So let's just do the happy birthday part first. Happy A string, third fret, birthday. Okay, now first fret, E string, dear. Now open, chew, C string, second fret, we. Okay, I'll count it. O, O, A string, three, open, E string, one, O, C string, two, okay? It's a lot of movement. I'll get even closer, right? O, O, A string, three, open, 
E string. One, oh, two. Good. If you want, you can just practice the left hand while I pluck it. Yeah? That way you could just focus on one thing. Yep. Yeah? And then you could try to add the plucking afterwards. Yep. Yeah? Okay, let's put the first three measures together. Here we go. Yeah? Right? We're going back to our O O two O, right? That's a more comfortable place to be, mostly on that open C string. Here we go. O O two O E string. One O O O two O. O O two O. Okay, the three on the E string. Three one. Okay, third measure. O O O O A string. Three O E string. One O C string. Two. Okay, now I'm going to try it with singing. All right, let's try it and. Happy birthday, E string, to you. Happy birthday to the three, to you. Happy A string, birthday, E string, dear Chewie. Okay? So. Again, if you need, pause there, rewind, practice. Now we add our fourth measure, which is totally different, but that's okay. We're getting used to it now, right? Now, if you take a look, we're starting on our A string on the first fret. So you can put your finger down here, right? A string, first fret, happy on the same note, right? Happy, then you go open, birth, then you go to the E string, one, then add your two, I would add both fingers there, just to, you get a more pressure if you put both fingers down. Yeah, ring finger on the third fret. Two, then lift up for the one again. You, okay. One more time, that last measure, starting with the one on the A string. Happy, open, birth. Keep that one just hovering over the E string. Day. Now add the two fingers for the three. Two. Lift up for the one again. You. Okay. You practice that measure by itself. Now let's put all four measures together. Here we go. From the top, I'll do the counting thing and then we'll do the singing thing. Okay. So starting with our O O two O, right? Nice and comfortable on that C string. Ready? O O two. E string, one, O, oh. back to O, O, two, O, 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 two, O, E string on the three, three, one, okay, O, O, A string, three, O, oh. E string, one, O, oh. C string, two, now back to the A string first fret, one, one, O, oh. E string, one, and then add, Okay, it's mostly about building up that association. Your brain has to see the number, then send a signal to your left hand for the fret, but then send a signal to your right hand for the string. It's a lot going on, so be patient with yourself and give your, uh, your two sides time to assess both parts. You can go monstrously slow. I love to practice slow, okay? So we're gonna play it all through. Let's do really slow one time, and then we'll do at a, a, a more regular tempo, okay? We'll sing it, but go really slow. Ready? And happy birthday, E string two. Okay, 
Remember there's a gear icon in the YouTube window where you can play back even slower. Okay, here we go. One last time, a little bit more up to tempo and happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Chewy. Happy birthday to you. Okay, so hopefully that gets you started with tab. You can learn this and play it for a loved one for their birthday. I promise that even if you mess up, they will totally love it. And you know, get your friends to sing. They'll just sing over you and it'll all be great. So thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Check out my other beginner ukulele tutorial and I will see you guys next time. Ciao. You ready? Happy birthday to Chewy. <laughs> Blackbird singing in the dead of night. Take these broken wings and learn to fly.